known as Princess India. And if you've noticed, again, I've been gone from my channel, but I have an explanation. It was not due to any other reason. That was the fact that I started working at my first job. I just recently happened to have turned 17 this past week or whenever this video comes out. Um, hold on one second. Okay, so with that being said, I think you guys can kind of understand where I'm coming from with this video. I am going to be showing you what I got for my 17th birthday. Uh, there are no like real videos or clips for my birthday if I can, I have like a few from like Snapchat. I didn't do anything, I didn't want to, I really hate being the center of attention, especially because it's my birthday. I do like presents, but I don't like being the center of attention, and um, a lot of people find that surprising seeing as I'm a Leo, people think they would like to be the center of attention. I really hate being the center of attention. I much would much rather know that I like you know care about me if you're like a close loved one I'd rather you care like I can feel like you love me and you care about me that's what I'd rather care about I hate being center of attention I just like to be the center of your love not like the center of your love but just know that you love me enough to care about me and think about me at some point in your time um yes so Anything, but I do have a little bit of clips because my co-workers don't like to listen to me, especially one co-worker um, made me some cupcakes. So, yeah. Caitlin, stop! <laughs> this is my second time trying to film this and hopefully it's not too long. Hopefully I don't talk a lot, but I talk a lot, so we'll see how that works. I got for my birthday a few things. I got one big thing. I got an iPhone. And actually, it's charging, so let me go pick it up. I got an iPhone. Oh my god. I got an iPhone. This is my iPhone. I have an iPhone 8. Um, I've, I think you've seen over the past few videos I didn't have an iPhone, and this is why it's so interesting, so a big deal to me. Um, my old phone, which I will show you the state of as of right now. I didn't lose it. I'm just on my bed. Um, yes. So, this is my new phone. iPhone. Yes. Looks very nice. Pristine. This is my old phone. It is a bootleg version of Galaxy. It is a Galaxy J3 Emerge. And apparently a lot of people are getting them because I think a lot of people are switching their companies or just upgrading and they can't upgrade because they left with these phones. And people who have these phones, I feel sorry for you. The phone is crap. Um, I don't really like Galaxies. I feel like they're not great quality. Having seen them, I've had one for at least four years now. Um, I've had the S4, S5, I think. I don't know about the S, I didn't get the S6. I had the S4 and S5, and then I had this one. Um, I cracked my S4, because I dropped it one day in the middle of the street when I had a Claire's phone case. But I love Claire's phone cases, because this one wasn't like a silicone one. And then the other one lasted for about, me about like two years or so. And I dropped this last summer running to the bus. I put it in my overalls, top of my overalls. You know the pockets are right, right there and some overalls. And I was like, you know, I gotta rush the bus and it fell on the ground. Battery fell out everything. So missed the bus. Didn't catch the bus at all. Um, I swear I saw people laughing at me on the bus. I'm not joking. Um, and it wasn't as bad, but because I have weird friends at school, um, one of my friends thought it was a great idea to pick some of those pieces off, off out of my phone screen. So I've been going without pieces of my phone screen for about like a few months or so. So, can't pull my phone up to my face, it gets too hot. I can burn the skin off of my face. 
Um, yes, yeah, so I'm done with that phone. I also, to go with the cheap phone, I got a cheap pop socket from Chinatown for $2, and that broke as well. So, um, everything's just broken on that phone. So, I was happy to get this new case that is still the same kind of case that my other phone broke in my S4. So, I should change that and get a silicone one, which is so one that came out now. It's a rainbow. And then, um, I hate these so much, but they're not pop, they could only cute pop socket. At Pro 21 at the time, it's an avocado! <laughs> yes, there are avocados on my pop socket, and I hate avocados, and I will talk about that sometime later, maybe in another video, but, yes. Um, that's that, it's an uh, iPhone 8, I love it, it's great. Um, so let's move on to actual things, other than the phone, other things that I got. Um, I bought a lot of stuff for myself for my birthday, like, it's my birthday, let me treat myself, you know. Um, I really wanted to sing a song by someone, but I shouldn't sing a song by so I can't. The moment is ruined. Um, okay, so, first, for my birthday, I'm really happy about because my birthday comes around like the time where there's a bunch of sales happening or like one sale's about to end and the, another sale's about to come up so all the stuff I got for myself or what I got for me for my birthday was on sale um so from Zara they're having like their semi-annual clearance or their summer clearance sale or something I don't know what it was because they weren't selling summer clothes they're selling a bunch of different clothes that weren't summer clothes um and it's like my first time shopping at Zara, so I'm actually proud of the things that I got. Um, my, for myself, I got these two lovely sweaters, although they're very itchy. And I tried to make them not itchy anymore. And they're not as itchy as before, but I mean, I did a whole thing with conditioner, hair conditioner, and vinegar, and didn't work, putting them in the freezer, I just dried them just a while ago, so, back to that, and then I also got it in this white color, so I have pink and white, so warm, but they're so itchy, um, so I must like take, most likely will take these to dry cleaners, and see if they can get rid of the itchiness, but I so because I need to get to be able to wear this because as we all saw the dinners are getting warm until literally June and that was scary because people thought it wasn't going to be warm this summer it is blazing hot first of all this summer so thank god for that um but I need these because it doesn't seem to get warm it seems to not become a consistent weather pattern I feel like in New York we only have Winter, winter with snow, and then winter without snow, or winter with rain. So it's winter with falling leaves, winter with snow, and winter with rain. And then it's summer, summer with rain, summer with all this kind of nonsense. Um, so, or we have the days in between where it's winter, summer, winter, summer, winter, summer, which is a great sight of, um, climate change but no one seems to listen to me so but and also from Zara again my mom got me this dress I wanted another dress to another dress from Zara it was like a black dress so kind of like reminding me of like a Wednesday Adam themed dress and I really wanted it because I think it's great for something I'm trying to work on or start working on um, uh, this is in a small, and I think this is $12.99, and the sweaters are $29.99, so I'm ready to wear these. Um, I, feel, I feel like I look like a Dalmatian at this. I can wear a National Dog Day and put some dog ears on and be like, I'm a Dalmatian. Um, that sounds stupid now that I say that. Um, next is this dress from Forever 21. Because it also reminds me of Wednesday Adams and a little Peter Pan collar. I live for a Peter Pan collar, honestly. I just live for it because they're so dang cute. Um, it's 
it's a gingham black and white. There's no sleeve. There's an A-line skirt. I just love it. There's not much to it. And I got this in the medium. But the part to put the button in is broken. Which I find funny because they give you an extra button, but they don't give you like another way to put an elastic on. But um, I can figure that out by sewing another one on or something like that. I'm just cutting a hole in it. I think this was, what was this? 20, 1990. Um, next, I got stuff from Urban Outfitters, which I purchased for myself. Um, I have this lovely gingham pastel purple jumpsuit scene happening over here. And I'm not a fan of jumpsuits or rompers because I'm really short. But people say my legs make up most of my body, but that isn't the case because my legs are short, so I'm short, so my legs make most of my body have a little short legs. So most of the time, rompers are too short or they ride up with thick thighs, so they give my chafe and it's just uncomfortable. And so the same things with rompers, but they happen quicker because they're rompers. And so I try to stay away from rompers and, so and jumpsuits. So I got like a romper and I also got a jumpsuit, but this is so comfy. It's like wearing a onesie, but you, the onesie you can wear inside. That people won't look at you weirdly. Um, so I was wearing it around the house for a couple days and then I had to wash it because it's kind of weird. Or not even wash because I wasn't. Around the house, I wore it for like 30 minutes and I wore it for like another three hours after. But I was clean. Um, this was originally $69 and I got it on the sale clearance for $34. So I say a good bargain. You know, I'm a bargain shopper. And then I got this lovely, I'm a gigum fan if you can't tell these lovely gingham yellow pants from Urban Outfitters. And they look nice, right? They're supposed to be cropped, but this is like the exact length of my of my leg. If you can't tell, I can't even put it in the whole frame. Look, look at that. That's my whole like length of my leg. And it's supposed to be cropped on the model's cropped. That model's like 5'7", I'm 5'2". Five, 5 inch difference, which is a lot of a difference. Like five seven five ten. I'm like, girl, of course they gave me cropped on you and they gave you a small. I need a medium and this is I'm five two. This is going to hit me around my leg. Sure did hit me right around my leg, my ankle. And I loved it. But it's kinda see-through. So you can see I had like patterned underwear on, so you can see the pattern through it. So I'm gonna have to buy some like spandex spider shorts to go on put on up this. It's just weird I have to put on the shorts. But you know, the things I do for the things that I love. I just love these pants. Okay, so next, my mom went to Century 21, as any middle-aged woman does for their child. She got me some Calvin Klein stuff, and things were like 70% off or more or whatever, or they went, I don't know, something up to 70% off. These together, well, this was $12.99 for this set. This was $23.99 for this set. So I think it's a fairly good price for Calvin Klein. And Calvin Klein is really isn't that expensive either, so depending on where you get it from. But I think this is super cute. And I love it. Like it makes a match with this set. Um Next, I got a couple of underwear from Pink. This is a black pair of boy shorts that have like a little sheer detailing on this, like on the side. Cute. This one is one with cherries on it, and it's like a kind of dusty periwinkle or something like that, dusty blue. Love it. Um, this one is a lavender underwear with another like sheer thing happening on the side of the leg then there's this one with a um peach with pink all over it and look like it's boy boxers and 
And then there's this one that is a blue box wreath kind of thing looking and it has paint on the bottom the back. And then I got this. And they're like in the same pattern, but they only have like five different colors in my, si in my size. And I need to get the other two because I think it's really cute. But this one is white with gold detailing. And these two are like a like blue and a lavender with silver detailing on it. And I got it in the small. And I don't know how much these costed. How much did these cost? $28, which I think is outrageous for a pair of bralettes, but I mean, they're good quality. You gotta go with the good quality. Yes. Um, then from Aeropostale, to stick with clothing, I got this shirt. I also got a pair of, two pairs of jeans, which one pair I'm wearing right now. Um, and then I got a shirt that says the coffee first and like that. I don't drink coffee. I can't have coffee because of ADHD. And that's just a disaster waiting to happen. And so I got this shirt that says New York Love, which I love New York. And it has is that hearts on it. I just know there's hearts on it. But it has like the the view top or the skyline or whatever on it in rainbow. And it was rainbow, so I had to get it. Um for accessories now. Um, for my phone, this is the case that my mom bought me originally with my phone, but I didn't want to keep a very expensive case on my phone. It was $40 from Sprint. Sprint, your cases are too expensive. Please lower the prices. They're phone cases. But I feel happy because it's a Kate Spade phone case and <sighs> R.I.P. Kate Spade. You are great. You are great. We love you. Um, I always wanted to shop at Kate Spade and I never got a chance because like we weren't in budget to buy Kate Spade, but now I kind of am. So I think I'll take a stop over at Kate Spade with a Kate Spade store or something and go get some stuff there. So um because of Sephora they give you your like birthday gift or whatever when it's your birth month. And I went on my birthday and got the gift, the two gifts, and one with the glam glow, one with a bite. Um Set. So I got the bike gift set and it has a what is that in here? I, I think it has a lipstick, a crown lip thing, and a lip scrub. Yeah, I don't know. It doesn't even say. A matte lip crayon. Oh, there's a moose boosh lipstick, matte cream lip crayon, and a agave lip balm. Um, these kind of like a mauve thing, so I don't know. Um, I want to find a perfect new color. Hopefully I did, but I doubt it. So, yes. I don't need this box anymore, so that's going over there. Ooh, I don't know how I feel about lip masks. They kind of scare me because I'm afraid to try them. But, this is the lipstick. It's very small. Travel size. I love them because they're so cute. Um, I slapped my finger and I don't know how or when, so that's why there's a Shopkins bandaid on it. And then here's the lip crayon. Did I smudge it already? Dang it. Okay, so that's how far it comes in. Oh, that's, far it comes in. Let's see. that's a good, like, amount of uses out of that, so depending on how thick you apply this. I don't want to swatch them because I want to keep them intact. Um, so that's that. And then for hair accessories. Lord Jesus, I just dropped this stuff. Um, I think I got two scrunchies from. Because we live for a scrunchie moment. This one is sequenced with rainbow sequins and then you can flip it and turn it silver. I love our reverse of this sequins. And then this one is gold with the words pink all over it. Can you see that? Let's see. Can you see that? I don't know. Can you? Is it on this side? Hopefully. Well, if you can't see it, then you can. If you can't, 
I'm sorry. Um, and then there's another set of scratches, Jesus, sorry, that I got from, um, Air Postel. This was the cutest thing ever. The pair looks super cute, but I can wear them together. Oh my goodness, look at that. That's just cute. Um, this one has palm leaves on it, and the other one is hot pink. I keep dropping these things, I'm sorry. Um, yes. The next two things, next three things I can try on, because they're not that hard, I don't think I have any clothes to try them on. Um, there is this pair of sunglasses that I got for myself at Oh yeah. I'm just, I just love this. But it's pink, people. It's pink. It's pink. I will not stop denying that. I mean, it's pink. Alright. Oh. I thought these were cloud glasses. They are not. I do want a pair of cloud glasses, sunglasses, because I think they're kind of cute. Um, and also look a little bit stupid. So I'm always okay with looking a little bit stupid at some time. But these are cute. And they're like cat eye, and I feel like I'm on the top of them. They're kind of tight on my glasses, the last two sunglasses, because they're like a thick band, so they're not like much give to them, and I have get migraines, and so they give me migraines. I can't this very long. I think this is like the perfect setup for how I can wear them, but that's kind of it. Like squeeze my head. That just means my head is a bit too big, and I don't want to admit that. Um, then there are these pair. They're so cute. I love them so much. I actually didn't want to get these at first because I saw other pairs like them. And this one has like a yellow tint for the sunglasses part. But the other ones have like a red tint or like a pink tint. And compared to these, to these, the other one thing looks like I was drunk. I didn't want to be walking around looking like I was drunk, even though I know I wasn't drunk, but also know I wasn't drunk. I just felt self-conscious feeling like I looked like a drunk person, so I decided not to get those sunglasses. So yeah, none of these are actually, except for the, the light ones, none of these are actually wearable for outside for a very long time. But I mean, fashion. Nothing that were actually that wearable for a long time. Things, but not everything. Um, I think it's the last thing. Um, this is this duffel slash weekender bag that I got from Victoria's Secret slash Pink because I spent over seventy five dollars. So I did some damage in there, and. I want to get another one, so I might give this away to somebody. My mom, preferably, because she's always at taking these my Victoria's Secret bags, so I may give it to her. And I think this is cute, but I want to get another one from Dolls too. That's pink and furry. So. And lastly, a pair of shoes that I got from Urban Outfitters. These are those Mary Jane flats leather Mary Jane flats. Um, they may look like they're old timey shoes and that's because they are and I love them. They're so cute. And I actually got this pair in white already but I need black. So now I got both pairs and I've accomplished my things. So and I got these in an 8 and they are usually $29. I just put myself in the face. Good things that you haven't touched the floor outside. Um, these were originally $29. I got them for $14.99 because they went on sale originally for $9.99. Then they went on sale again for $14.99. So you're basically getting like $4 and a cent taken off. But like, I mean, a bargain's a bargain, <laughs> no matter where you get it from. Um, yeah. I think that is all for this video. And again, this video is long. Hi, 
Why? Why can I ever stop talking? Um, yeah, I hope you guys like the new intro because of my new phone. I can edit better things, hope oh, for better things. I can edit better, add little things in like I couldn't with my iPad. So, yeah, hopefully you'll get better quality things or more better editing. Who knows? The possibilities are endless, and I hope you like the new background I'm trying out. I don't know how long we'll keep it. I'm kind of liking it, because I can switch it out to Christmas time, cover it up with some stuff. Yeah, I like it, and I think it's cute. So, yeah. Um, okay. I need to get something for a second so I can get my thumbnail. It's my lovely crown. I have in my room from Claire's. Oh yeah. I find it funny that I have this crown. So, my camera turned off, but this is my crown that I wore like two years ago for my birthday, and I think I might start wearing it more in my videos. Maybe it's a new era. Maybe it's actually the princess era of my channel. Um, but yes, I am done with this video. And I hope you got some type of enjoyment out of this video, some type of entertainment. I'm sorry if you didn't. I am a quite boring person. And yes. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you for clicking. Thank you for watching it for this long. I am sorry. But uh, um, there's some stuff to come. Hopefully. Maybe another look. But it's been a year since I posted one. Or about one. About a year since I posted one. Maybe I'll post one again. Um, yes, there are some new things on top of my channel, so it'll be like an update, life update thing. Um, yes, I have some new content coming your way. Um, thank you for watching this video. I hope you have a wonderful day. And day, night, afternoon, whenever you're watching this video. 3 a.m. in the morning and ice cream. on my social media and subscribe put your post notifications on you know I'd really like it if you did and I'll see you in the next video which is not probably either before the next video I don't know I'll just see you in the next video